What's going on YouTube? It's Rashad from Sneaker NBA Music, the channel. Backup had it with a very, very exciting pickup. It is a sneaker pickup, and um, I'm just really excited about finally getting the shoe. Uh, ordered the shoe from Nike.com on Monday, and today is Thursday, and it shipped. I was expecting a seven-day delivery, but uh, can't complain with early results. And um, here it is. As you can see, they packaged the shoe very well. Uh, last time I ordered uh, from Foot Locker, it came with, uh, again, UPS, but it came in a bag, in a plastic bag, literally, almost like a plastic bag, and the sh sneaker box was inside, and my box was crushed. Um, I mean, it, it, I mean, I kind of want my box to be in good condition, uh, but I didn't mind with those, because those KD4s were for basketball, so I didn't, I didn't need the box. But this shoe, I was, like, hoping and praying that they boxed it up nicely, because I want this box, because this is my first um, shoe from this um, series. Uh, it is a Nike shoe, so um, you guys know what it is already by the title, so uh, I just want to keep it confidential until you actually see it, just for my satisfaction, I guess. But um, here is the, uh, I guess, the return um, authorization thing here. If you want to return them, you got to fill this out. And right here is the order, the ordering um, report, like what you ordered and crap from Foot Locker. And, um, I paid retail for these um, I'm from Nike.com, sorry. So um, I don't know um, if the packaging has to do with the website you order from or actual people who are delivering it to you because both times are from UPS. This time, great packaging. Last time, horrible packaging. This time, Nike.com. Last time, Footlocker.com. So, um, yeah. But overall, uh, Nike.com, if you are responsible, you did a great job. Um, and here it is, guys. Boom, uh, right there. Kobe 7s, my first ever pair of Kobe's, first ever pair of Kobe 7s. Um, you can see by the box, Kobe logo, the Shizoko logo I believe it's called. You have this um, rigid pattern that's featured all over the shoe, almost like a corduroy pattern. <laughs> Label, and a uh, nice box. Uh, it's nice that they gave Kobe a box from the Zoom Kobe 6s and from these. Um, you know, as like they gave Kobe, uh, LeBron a box and whatnot. So I'm just waiting for Kevin Durant to get his own box for his sneaker. Uh, but Guys, when I say that this is a dope colorway, I really mean it. My pickup for today, the Zoom Kobe 7 Shark. You can see, let me just adjust the light. You can see, boom, the Zoom Kobe 7 Shark. I mean, uh, just looking at the shoe off the top, I mean, it's just such a clean cut shoe. Just look at that really feeling this shoe. I mean, when I first seen it, I wasn't really into it, but uh, it grew on me, and it grew on me a lot to a point where I looked for it, and I found it for retail. Very for hypey about that. But uh, let's just get into a quick review, I guess. You guys seen a bunch of Kobe 7 reviews, but uh, here's mine. Uh, the shoe is finished off with a uh, nice um, rigid patterning around the shoe. I believe this is for some type of basketball support because it is a performance shoe at first. Um, I do not know what it is exactly it's called, but uh, it's featured all around the shoe. It's almost like a corduroy pattern, as you can see. Um, very uh, interesting look. Gives it a very interesting look. And with the Kobe 7 um, Sharks, uh, it's finished off with a... Um, what is called the current blue all around the upper with these um, hits of waves I guess that they're trying to make it look like a uh, water because these are the sharks um, but it looks more like lightning all the reviewers that have done reviews on this shoe have said the same thing it does look like lightning but neither the less it is a very dope um, a very dope addition to the shoe it makes the shoe really pop as opposed to just having it as a plain blue but uh, I don't know if you can see it from that shot and all that design there but uh, there it is um, really like that part of the shoe when I see it in person at the um, store. I was like, I wanted them. They didn't have my size at the store, so I had to order them online. But um, again, um, the uh, bottom of the shoe finished off with white right here. Very thick around this area. Again, for your support while playing basketball. Um, this lettering, this secret coding by Kobe. Uh, I forgot. I remember what it was. Um, what it said. A reviewer on YouTube here. Um, decoded it for us, but I forgot right now, but it is like a secret coding from Kobe to his fans, I guess um, The lacing is uh, obsidian blue with uh, blue tips and then on the tongue is finished off with a um, Kobe logo that he uses on his shoes uh, From the fifth shoe, I believe he, or the fourth shoe he started using this logo um, Is the Shizoko logo, I believe it's called um, Inside finished off with the off blue 
Oh, not off boom. Sorry, current blue. Uh, really nice with the placed fast in uh, um, insole. Uh, this uh, Kobe Seven only comes with one insole as opposed to the two insoles that come with the Supreme Pack, um, which I don't mind because I'm not using these for basketball purposes. But if you are um, planning to buy these for basketball, I suggest you look into buying um, the Supreme Pack, just because it comes with uh, that little ankle booty or insole that um, gives you a lot more lockdown feel on your ankle. Uh, but aside from that, the ankle. Uh, cushioning on this sh low top and so is really really nice uh, cushioning is just like I don't know if you can see how fat it is but um as you can see the cushioning is really really nice it feels really glad I'm uh, really good well um, without me even um, breaking them in and wearing them just on my hands they feel great um, I'm moving on to the uh, bottom of the shoe it finishes off with a um um the traction here um, with the Kobe uh, Shizoko logo and your hits of carbon fiber right there. Um, they, they went back to the um, herringbone patterning on the traction and over here a little bit of storytelling. Uh, but um, So the traction for ball pairing purposes does look good on the shoe and I've heard great things about it. But again, I'm not going to use these for ball. I have my KD so there's no need for me to have a new basketball shoe. But uh, I will be rocking these man for casual wear, rocking the hell out of these because these look really dope. Uh, also, the shoe features white swoosh both sides and on the back, a uh, nice heel cup for a nice support on your heel. Um, Kobe signature, and then you have the shark right here representing Kobe 7 sharks. And these are a part of the Predator pack, which is uh, the Kobe 7 sharks, the Kobe 7 cheetahs, which released on Christmas time, and the uh, Kobe 7 wolf grays, which are also out, and the poison dart frogs, which I believe are a part of the pack. but my box just fell <laughs> but uh, uh correct me if i'm wrong i believe the kobe 7 um poison dart frogs are part of the pack um i would guess so with the poison dart frog on the back of the shoe but um correct me if i'm wrong but um yeah you can see both the sharks you can see both the shoes side to side dope shoe really glad to finally have a pair of kobe's and this will not be my last pair of kobe's i will be looking into doper colorways i might want to cop i'm really feeling those poison dart frogs um, so maybe that will be my next cop. As you can see, Kobe 7 Sharks overall, I'm really satisfied with my pickup from online. And um, if you guys, you know, like them from this video, for other videos, I mean, I suggest you cop. You can still find them for retail. So uh, buy them before, uh, you know, resellers or whatever uh, take advantage of them being sold out and sell it to you for uh, the price for no reason. Um... Oh, another thing I forgot to show you guys. Uh, the front of the shoe right here does say something. It says KB24, Kobe Bryant 24, the Nike check. Uh, yeah. Uh, well, Kobe, you know, you finally impressed me with the sneaker. <laughs> I'm not the biggest Kobe fan, but I got to say, you put out a great sneaker. This is a great, clean sneaker. But um, thank you guys for watching. Um, the next video will be the Playoff 12 review. I've known... I've uh, been slacking on that, but um, it's actually a long story behind it. I'm actually getting my actual pair tomorrow, and I will be doing a review on it. Um, it's a long story with the size swapping, but um, I might have a review for it tonight um, with my size 12 pair. I did do a review on it. I just didn't put it up, but um, I might put it up uh, because, I mean, what's the difference reviewing a size 12 and a size 10? But... Uh, um, We'll see what happens. Uh, maybe I'll um, upload it after this video. but uh, Or maybe I'll just wait for my size 10 to come in and I'll review that for you. Make a whole new video. But until next time, guys, uh, thank you so much for watching. Rate, subscribe, comment. Again, Zoom Kobe 7 Sharks. Dope, dope shoot. Uh, peace.